now that our O'Day widget is off of the trailer, we have the trailer put in the garage and we're going to start wire wheeling it. Uh, we grabbed a Harbor Freight uh, variable speed drill corded into a few wire wheels and just started having at stripping the trailer the best we could. Um, we didn't get, try to get all of the paint and the rust off the trailer, but we got the good bulk of it along with uh, any of the big chunks of flaky nastiness that was on the trailer. So now that it's stripped, uh, we'll work on painting the trailer uh, later on. The painting we'll be using on this trailer is Rust-Oleum Professional Oil-Based Paint. Uh, I've used it in many different applications. It's not too expensive, so we're going to use it for this. It's available in a spray can as well, so we can color match it and get those hard-to-reach areas as well. Is there better selections of materials? Yes, but you can use this without worrying about uh, you know, serious medical side effects. Prior to painting, you'll need to wipe down all the surfaces on the trailer with either mineral spirits or acetone. Uh, this particular paint calls for mineral spirits, so that's what we went ahead and used. Uh, you just want to make sure there's no grease or leftover dust that will keep the paint from adhering well to the trailer. Uh, the dry time on this particular paint uh, can be over a week, so you'll need to give it plenty of time. Uh, but it's about one day between coats. We did three coats of paint on this trailer and we're hoping that after a month or so it'll dry really really hard and we found it to be extremely indestructible i've even painted the car with it so uh, it's a testament to how well this paint really does work uh, we're going to paint it with a paint roller and uh, some foam brushes and any of the really hard reach areas we'll use the spray can to reach those places as well When painting with this paint, you'll want to use a very high nap roller. Uh, the thicker the roller, the more texture you will get on the, uh, the trailer, and it'll help cover up some of the sore spots on the trailer that can be eyesores. Uh, 